Good morning, everyone. Hey, I was over here looking at my editing device. I got two videos I haven't put out. One purposely. Uh, the second one was, um, I forgot, and it was doing my garlic. Um, I did the garlic, probably it's been about a month now, but it was either the day before me having my knee surgery or two days prior. I was rushing to get things done. And um, so that is what this video is. It's four weeks ago, it's done, but also I did uh, a video at the very end where I put hay on top of all of it. And I remember sometime doing one of my first videos about my knee, I'm back home, and I remember it hit and delete by accident. So me showing you how to put hay on top of the garlic, you guys know how to do it, but that's what I did do. There, what, there is hay on top of the garlic. All right, we'll see you later. Thanks for watching, and thanks for your support. Have a great day. Bye. All right, it's time for me to get my garlic in the ground. As you see, I've got, that's a kind of a small one, but I've got a lot bigger ones inside. You see them on the bottom. And so what we're going to do, I think I've got 22 here. And uh, I'm going to use this as my depth. Push this in there. Push that in and then cover it up. Remember, when you plant your um, garlic, you plant the root side uh, uh, down. So always remember, there's your bottom root side right there, and there's your top perfect example right there you can see it that's the bottom so these will go planted down in the hole this way this is what I've done I don't want to step in the garden because right now this is very fluffy it's super nice um, back if you see me a couple weeks ago I had a big hill I had a lot of grass in here but I did go ahead and get my con I went to my furthest compost pile back that's where I um, took all my uh, um, goat uh, poop and um, heavy bedding for the chickens. I brought in a, a about, about three quarters of a bucket of that in here, in here, and I just took it, kept flipping around, flipping around. This has been a couple weeks ago. We got good rain last night, and I definitely need to get it done. But what I'm not going to do is I don't want to step on in here. I'm going to step on this board and then plant. Try to use that as my guideline and plant all the way across and just go all the way across as far as I can. So we're going to go ahead and get this planted, get it in the ground, and um, start it for next year. And today is um, October 11th, and uh, we should be pulling this out of the ground sometime in, uh, say, July-ish of next year. Alright, you see me get those planted. I'm gonna bore you if I show you planting anymore. And um, that's what we're gonna do. What do we do? We planted one, two, three, four, five, six, right? I think we did six. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, seven. So we got seven across. Alright, I did get the garlic done. And what I did was, uh, I believe I planted 26 and I stopped it right there. And I've got them probably uh, eight inches apart, both ways, and um, all the way across. I'm gonna, uh, like my wife said, I w was going in to grab a whole bunch more, and uh, like she said, you can only eat so much garlic, which is true. And um, I mean, what we have will be just barely enough for us this year. So I did plant another 12 more than I did last year, I believe it was. So. Um, that's good. We'll, we'll stick with what we got. The soil's excellent. It's very soft. As you can see, I didn't even step on it. That's what I did not want to do, step on it. So, we stopped right there. So, from here over, it's all garlic. From here, I can start laying compost in here and stuff. Let it sit. And uh, let that go, you know. 
um, eggshells and everything. I want to start laying this thing. But this ground is super good. They both are. Like I said, this is a huga culture. That is a huga culture. And this is about 75% uh, of it is. So. All right. Well, garlic is in. And uh, move on to the next thing. I've got to get done. All right.